He sleeps. He eats. He stretches his legs every hour. It's not easy. All day long. A little baby like this requires around the clock care. He needs to drink every hour throughout the night even. Simona Netherlands of the Salt River Wild Horse Management Group turned her kitchen and living room into a horse nursery because it's just too hot outside. We take his temperature all the time because he can't regulate his own temperature. So even if he goes outside for half an hour in his temperature, he overheats. So he can only be outside for 10 minutes. So imagine if he was outside out there, he would not have made it for very long. Someone found the little guy Sunday, separated from the herd in the Tonto National Forest and called the group's hotline. We just literally got there right in time. Netherlands says he had just been born, a preemie, possibly to a malnourished mare. It's something they've seen a lot amid Arizona's drought. This year, the group started dropping off hay for the wild horses every day. It's simply just so dry, there's no ground cover left. It's really an emergency measure for us to feed the horses. It's not something we, we've ever done before or that we ever thought we had to do. Now that this three-day-old horse has gotten used to people, the group says he'll live out the rest of his life at their horse sanctuary in Prescott. And the group is taking suggestions on a name for this little guy. And for more on that, go to our website, azfamily.com. I'm Derek Stahl for Arizona's Family.